This is the book of Matthew chapter 24 and verse 13. And it reads, but he that shall endure unto the end, the same shall be saved. All right. Brakata Yahweh, Brakata Yahweh Shai, Brakata Yahweh, Brakata Yahweh Shai, Brakata Yahweh, Brakata Yahweh Shai. First and foremost, I want to give all praises, all honor, and all glory unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rechakodash. I want to give double honors to my apostles and elders at Great Millstone, which rule well. And I want to give a peace, greetings, and salutations to all the Lagakim that's pushing his word in our truth and sincerity, you know, throughout the four corners of the earth. It's like, a, you know, and the brothers that's not wavering in faith, you know, being diligent in his truth. You know, I say shalom to you, brothers, you know, and I say shalom, you know, to the few sisters that believe in all meekness and humbleness. You know, I, I say shalom. You know, uh, I'm your brother Zakaria from GMS Miami Camp. And Lord willing, you know, through the spirit and power of Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Makaka Dash, you know, uh, Adawan Rathaza, you know, that means Lord willing, you know, so Lord willing, this lesson is edifying to the lack of the nation of Israel. You know, my lesson today, you know, through the spirit and power of Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Makaka Dash, is going to be basing on keep enduring, all right? Keep enduring because the Lord, uh, He's not a man that He should lie. The Lord said, if we endure, all right, we're going to be delivered. All right, and the Lord is going to give us our heart's desire in the kingdom of heaven. All right. The Lord, he's going to put the law of commandments in our, in our inward part. All right. Talking about the nation of Israel, starting with the elect. All right. The elect of the nation of Israel. All right. In the nation of Israel, all you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. All right. Also, the Israelite foreigners that scattered amongst the nations, that lineage, go back to the 12 tribes according to their fathers. All right. All right. We are the true biblical Hebrew Israelites. And the Lord is going to save the elect of his people, man, the remnant. All right. And through the elect being delivered. All right. Well, when when the elect get delivered, right, the Lord's going to change all right, the elect's body. You know, we parry a part of the elect. All right. And the Lord going to put his law touching memories in, in their inward parts, man. All right. And through the elect, all right, the nations. All right. The, the elect is going to bring back the nation of Israel and Israel shall all be righteous. And the Lord's going to bless us abundantly. All right. But it's about enduring in these times. All right. Enduring, 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 all right, the hour of temptation, all right, when all hell is breaking loose. And the Lord, he's going to be faithful, as he always is. All right, so Matthew 24 and verse um, 13 again says, but he, but he that shall endure unto the end, the same shall be saved. And this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for a witness unto all nations. And then shall the end come. And this gospel is preached has been preached you know throughout the four corners of the earth man you know via the internet you know all right when our apostles and elders got on got on youtube i believe it was the 2007 2007 all right all right this truth has been made global you got brothers all over the earth you know waking up all right to know that they're israelites all right knowing the true name of the heavenly father which the heavenly father's name is yahweh and his son name is yahweh shah all right. And the Lord has poured out his Holy Spirit all right, upon all right, his prophets to preach his word, man, you know, and to give us warning. All right. I right, give us warning of the things that is about to happen, the prophecies, man. And the Lord said, if we stay faithful and, and continue to endure, we're going to be delivered. And you got to have that um, that faith to believe that. All right. This is the book of Numbers, chapter 23. Bear with me. Number chapter 23, verse 19. It says, Yahweh is not a man that he should lie. So the Lord is not a man that he should lie. Neither the son of man that he that he should repent. Have he said and shall not he do it? If the Lord said it, shall he not do it? All right. Or have he spoken and shall not he make it good? All right. Because the Lord, the Lord is not just going to say something. All right. And then just make it go void. Nah, the Lord is not like that. This is the book of Isaiah chapter 55 and verse 11. It says, so shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth. It shall not return, un uh, return unto me void, but it shall accomplish that which I please. And it shall prosper in the thing whereto I sent it. All right. So the Lord said, the, 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 so shall the word be that goeth forth out of, my, out of his mouth. All right. It shall not return unto him void. All right. So the Lord not just going to make make just just empty talk how these how these jakes are in the world all right just say they just say stuff and don't um and don't uh 
come good on it, you know? You know, they'll make a promise or something, and then they'll end up, you know, not accomplishing the promise that they that they told someone. All right? The most high Yahweh Bashima Shah is not like that. She just say Yahweh Shah the same yesterday. Bear with me. Hebrews 13 and 8. It says Yahweh Shah Hamashiach, the same to slot the same yesterday and today and forever. So the son of men, our Lord Yahweh Shah, our, our Savior, he doesn't change. All right. This book of Isaiah chapter 14. Isaiah chapter 14 and verse 24 says the Lord of hosts have sworn saying surely as I have thought so shall it come to pass and as I have proposed all right proposed so shall it stand all right so the Lord said it all right he thought of it so shall it come to pass and as he have proposed so shall it stand man so the word of the Lord is going to stand we just got to continue enduring all right, and our reward is coming. After after we receive, all right, after we do the work. This is the book of Hebrews, chapter 10, in the verse. Hebrews 10 and verse 35. It says, Cast not away therefore your confidence, which have great recompense of reward. So don't cast away your faith, man. All right. Because there's a reward. Verse 36. For ye have need of patience, meaning to suffer, that after ye have done the will of the Most High, after you've done the will of the Most High, doing this work, prophesying, you know, being diligent, being on fire for this truth, ye might receive the promise, man. All right. Let me go to, let's get a preset right quick. Second Peter 1. Second Peter chapter 1 and verse... 10 it says wherefore the rather brethren give diligence to make your calling in election sure so got to give diligence if ye do these things ye shall never fall for so an entrance shall be ministered unto you abundantly into the everlasting kingdom of our lord and savior yahweh shah mashiach so an everlasting all right uh, entrance going to be ministered unto us abundantly into the lord's everlasting kingdom man all right which the elect is going to be joint heirs with the lord man all right. And the blessings that Yahweh Shai I right, is about to give us, I right, I have not seen, neither ear heard, man. The Lord's gonna deck us out, man. The earth is gonna be refreshed. I right, the earth is gonna rejoice again. I right, these heathens, they're gonna be under subjection under us. Started with Esau, Edom, the so-called white man. And after a thousand years of hardcore slavery, bondage, all right, because we're gonna overtake them, all right, all these nations. All right. In the captivity, the hard abundance that we was made to serve, they're going to serve it double. All right. After a thousand years, it's like it. You know, they're going to pay. They're going to have to pay for what they did after a thousand years of hardcore bondage. All right. All right. The nation of Edom. All right. The whole nation of Edom is right, going to be eradicated by fire. Thus said the Bible. All right. Obadiah verse 18. Hebrews chapter 10. In verse 35, again, it says, Cast not away, therefore, your confidence, which have great recompense of reward. For ye have need of patience, that after ye have done the will of the Most High, ye might receive the promise. That's what I would say. Give diligence to make your calling election sure. If you do these things, you shall never fall. Fall out the truth. Verse 37. For yet a little while, and he that shall come will come. Talking about our Lord, Yahweh Shai. And will not tarry. All right, let's get let's let's get a preset right here. Revelation chapter 22. And Revelation 22 and verse 12. It says, "And behold, I come quickly." This is our Lord Yahweh speaking. And my reward is with me to give every man according as his work shall be, man. So every man going to get all right, a reward according to his work, man. All right, if you was being slothful, all right, the Lord going to destroy you. That's going to be your reward. If you was being diligent, the Lord going to give you salvation. You know, if you're a part of the elect. Hebrews 10 and verse um, uh, 37. And the Lord said he come quickly. It says, for yet a little while, and he 
that shall come will come and would not tarry. Verse, tarry, verse 38. And now the just shall live by faith. All right, the elect. But if any man draw back, would well, draw back into the world that he because he couldn't endure. All right. My soul shall have no pleasure in him. So the Lord ain't going to have no pleasure in you. Verse 39 says, for we are not of them who draw back into perdition, meaning destruction. We're not we are not of them who draw back, but of them that believe to the saving of the soul, man. All right. You believe you confess his word. All right. Trip say the engrafted word in the graph. This is the book of James chapter one, verse 21. It says, wherefore, lay aside all filthiness and superfluity of naughtiness and receive with meekness the engrafted word, which is able to save your souls, man. All right. We believe to the savings of the soul, man. All right. We believe in this doctrine, the gospel. All right. So the Lord said his reward is with him, man. All we got to do is endure. Revelation 2 and verse 25. It says, but that which ye have already hold fast till I come, meaning it's truth. And he that overcometh, and how do we overcome? Through our Lord Yahweh Shai. We get the victory through our Lord Yahweh Shai, you know, and by, you know, enduring, all right? He that overcometh, all right, ultimately, you know, being delivered, you know, enduring, doing the, doing the uh, Jacob's trouble, the hour of temptation, all right? And keeping my works unto the end, to him will I give power over the nations. So the Lord will give us power over the nations, all right? Over our enemies, uh, over these heathens. And he, verse 3, 27, and he shall rule them with a rod of iron. So the Lord will give us a rod of iron, man, to rule over these demons, these other nations. As the vessel of a potter shall they be broken, shall they be broken to shivers. Even as I received of my father, and, what, and where did uh, the Lord uh, get this power and dominion? All right, uh, we read uh, Psalms the second chapter, Daniel the seventh, Daniel the seventh chapter. The Lord gave our our Lord Yahweh Shai, Yahweh gave Yahweh Shai all power and all dominion that all these nations should serve Him, man. All right, and He's gonna have an everlasting kingdom. So if we if we, if we endure, the Lord's gonna give us a hundredfold. He don't give us everlasting life. All right. So it's all about enduring, you know. So this was just a quick lesson, you know, through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai Bahashem, Kakadash. You know, Lord willing, it was edifying to the elect. You know, I want to give all praises, all honor, and all glory, you know, to, to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai Bahashem, Kakadash. I want to give double honors to my apostles and elders at Great Millstone with Ruel. And I want to give a peace, greetings, and salutations to all the elect. I can not pushing his word and truth and sincerity. Hey, shalom, I can keep pushing, keep doing shalom.